Welcome to the lesson on keys to using an AED. In this video, we'll review some key points for using an AED. You're likely to find an automated external defibrillator, or AED, in the public spaces you visit. An AED is both sophisticated and easy to use, providing life-saving power in a user-friendly device, which makes it useful for people who have never operated one and for anyone in stressful scenarios. However, proper use of an AED is very important. Attach the pads to the upper right side and lower left side of the individual's chest. Once the pads are attached correctly, the device will read the heart rhythm. If the pads are not attached correctly, the device will indicate so with prompts. Once the rhythm is analyzed, the device will direct you to shock the individual if a shock is indicated. A shock depolarizes all heart muscle cells at once, attempting to organize its electrical activity. In other words, the shock is intended to reset the heart's abnormal electrical activity into a normal rhythm. When using an AED, keep these key points in mind. Assure oxygen is not flowing across the individual's chest when delivering shock. Do not stop chest compressions for more than 10 seconds when assessing the rhythm. Stay clear of patient when delivering shock. Assess pulse after first two minutes of CPR. If the end tidal carbon dioxide is less than 10 millimeters of mercury during CPR, consider adding a vasopressor and improve chest compressions. This concludes our lesson on keys to using an AED. Next, we'll review criteria to apply AED and basic AED operations.